Hi, I'm Stacy Wilhelm, and the scripture I would like to share is in 1 Nephi chapter 17. It's actually um, a comparison of four different scriptures. Um, first, in verses 20 and 21, Laman and Lemuel are talking about the journey that they've experienced. Thou art like unto our father, led away by the foolish imaginations of his heart. Yet he hath led us out of the land of Jerusalem, and we have wandered in the wilderness for these many years. And our women have toiled, being bid with child, and they have borne children in the wilderness, and have suffered all things, save it were death. And it would have been better that they had died before they came out of Jerusalem, than to have suffered these afflictions. Behold, these many years we have suffered in the wilderness, which time we might have enjoyed our possessions, and the land of our inheritance, yea, we might have been happy. And then, speaking about the exact same journey in um, the first two chapters, their brother Nephi the prophet says, And it came to pass that we did again take our journey in the wilderness, and we did travel nearly eastward from that time forth. And we did travel and wade through much affliction in the wilderness, and our women did bear children in the wilderness. And so great were the blessings of the Lord upon us, that while we did live upon raw meat in the wilderness, our women did give plenty of suck for their children, and were strong, yea, even like unto the men, and they began to bear their journeyings without murmuring. And thus we see that the commandments of God must be fulfilled. And if it be that the children of men keep the commandments of God, he doth nourish them, and strengthen them, and provide means whereby they can accomplish the thing which he has commanded them. Wherefore, he did provide means for us while we did sojourn in the wilderness. So even though they were taking the exact same journey, Nephi um, was grateful in all things and for the blessings that the Lord had given them. Um, I know that the Book of Mormon is of God and I am grateful for its relevance in my life right now and I know it was written for us in this time and I say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.